Hey, what's going on guys? This is uh, Anthony Abram. And as you can see, I got on my sun hat, my shades, and my, my camel pack. I just finished um, doing my, my early morning exercise. So good morning to you, how you doing? Um, today, today's um, magnetic minute is the mess. I wanna to talk to you quickly about the mess in the message. Now this morning, um, I got a text message from someone that I admire and I got bad news that uh, they had got served with divorce papers. And when I got it, you know, I felt bad. I felt bad for them that they, um, that that was happening to them. And it made me flash back to a time period in my life when, when this had happened to me too. Um, I. When, I, when a relationship had dissolved and um, it seemed like the world was just simply coming to an end. And, you know, they say that bad things happen in threes. Well, for me, it seemed like bad things happened in like four, five, sixes, and sevens. Um, there was the, the, the dissolving of the relationship. There was losing a job, a high paying job that I was, that I loved in an industry that I was crazy about there was the subsequent um then you know losing a dream home that i built from the ground up uh losing cars to repossession and and then being you know filing for bankruptcy and just falling flat on my ass and not knowing where to go where to turn to what to happen um, mother being, you know, sick, uh, being raised a only child and not really having anybody to turn to, ended up being a, in the midst of it all, to just pile on more shit on top of shit, end up a, a penny per mile truck driver and brushing my teeth in the back of a truck stop and sleeping in the back of a truck because I don't have a place to live. And I just simply want to share with you guys that sometimes it can seem like it's getting, it's, it's bad. It's bad. It's bad, bad, bad. Instead of you knowing that there's a bad time, take the time, cry, get it out, you know, mourn. I did it. But know that when you get through that, what you don't want to do is you don't want to give up. You know, you don't want to give up your your battles. I had entrepreneurial, you know, dreams, because what you want to do is you want to keep moving. Because the, it's funny thing how how you know the the creator works is that he shows you. It's like when you're a little kid, you know, and you you go to stick your hand on the stove, and you burn. You learn, you know. Uh, your parents keep telling you to do something, you know, and they keep telling you to do it over and over and over again. Pick up your clothes, you know, do what you do. And they're telling you that over and over and over because there's a, a lesson to be learned in it. Instead of looking at the, the bad stuff as just the end all be all, I want you to instead turn it around, re-engineer it, and look for the lesson that's inside of it, that it's preparing you for. There's something inside of there. See, understand, had I not gone through that process, I wouldn't be able to share with you guys today the stories about being an entrepreneur who overcame serious crap serious shit i couldn't tell you that i couldn't tell you exactly about how to create an organization you know how i tried to hire people you know all these things happened after that um people firing you know hiring family that did, didn't work out um but ultimately now i sit back and i think about my life and i think about you know i've met someone who i did love who loved me back and we have a beautiful child together and it's an amazing journey because there was a message, there was a lesson that I had to learn in that training. And I want you guys to look for the message in the mess. Look for the training that the creator is trying to teach you in that process and you too can overcome. So with that being said, leave you guys with this. I'm asking if you found uh, joy in this message and please share it. Um, I invite your comments below. I look at them. I look at, I read them. 
And if you are looking for an entrepreneurial community where you can, you know, rub elbows and be around like minded people, then I want to invite you to be a part of Magnetic Networking Live dot com. It's a Facebook group where other entrepreneurs are at. So with that being said, thank you guys for taking the time. Be encouraged. As always, I leave you with this. Sow good seeds. Do good work. Reap. Then teach to repeat. Love you guys.